false start bedtimes and why they're happening from a pediatric sleep consultant. And don't forget to share this video with other parents that may be struggling with sleep. A false start bedtime is when you've completed your perfect bedtime routine, you've placed your baby down, they've gone to sleep, everybody's happy, and at least one sleep cycle later, so at least 45 minutes to an hour later, they suddenly wake up. The most common reason that this happens, or that night wakings happen at all in the first part of the night, so before midnight, is because your baby's overtired. It should actually take your baby about 15 to 20 minutes to fall asleep. There are babies that can fall asleep faster than that, and for some it may take a few minutes longer. But if your baby is getting into bed and literally within two to three minutes crashing and falling asleep, it's a sure sign that they're overtired. Your baby's body is smart and it recognizes that your baby is tired or fatigued. So what it does is it gives your baby more active sleep. And it's because of that more active sleep that they're much more likely to wake up. Typically in the first part of the night, your baby's getting their deepest and most restorative sleep. But when a baby is overtired, their body simply won't let them do that. And instead active sleep takes over. Solving this can be a combination of simply looking at your baby's schedule and making sure it's biologically appropriate, checking that the wake windows are within range, your baby isn't getting too much daytime sleep, all things that the Smart Sleep Coach by Pampers can help do for you so that you don't have to think about it and you can make sure that your baby gets on a schedule that works for them and for you and you get your evenings back.